Hey there, it's Brandon. And today I want to show you that you can set up a service or lesson or appointment based business on the Shopify platform with the help of one simple app. So I'm going to show you how to install that app today and answer that question of can I sell things other than products on Shopify? The answer is yes, and I'm going to show you how. Okay, before we get started, I just want to let you know that we're going to break this tutorial into a series of different videos so it's much easier to consume instead of one really long one. So in this first video here, we're just going to focus on finding the app and downloading it to your Shopify store. So let's go ahead and jump right into our Shopify main menu here. And along the left hand side, go ahead and click on apps and it'll take you to this screen that's showing right here in the middle. Up on the top right, you'll have a green button saying customize your store. Go ahead and click on that. And that's gonna take you to the App Store. If you haven't been here before, there's thousands of different apps that you can use and you can spend literally days looking at all kinds of amazing things. But let's move directly to the app that we want to be using in this situation. And we can search for it right in the search field here. What you wanna enter in is the appointment booking app and then hit enter. Now that's going to pull up a whole bunch of different apps that you could potentially use and feel free to go through and, and look at other ones, maybe even use other ones that you may be more inclined or find interesting. But the one that I recommend is the one that pulls up right here at the top below these other ones that are paid ads. And it's the appointment booking app by Side Panda. So go ahead and click on that one. And let's take a look at this app real quick before we actually install it on the store. I just want to point out uh, a few things. So the first thing, obviously, right off the top is they have 91 reviews and they're five star. So that speaks volumes about the quality uh, of the application there now you can watch this video you can dig into all the features they have like single multi-day booking email text notification advanced features they have images that you can look at that show what the app could potentially look like on your website if you get into some design features and and these types of things you scroll down a little bit further and you'll see about the app. Go ahead and click the show full description and you can read through and see much more details about the application and what is all involved there. Now below that, I want to talk a little bit about the pricing. So most apps will give you a seven day or 14 day free trial. And there are a few that do have free tier pricing. I really like that this one has a free tier, although it's only one product. What I like about the free tier is when you download an app, you can really give it a test drive under a free level plan and really see if it can do what you need it to do. And then if those features aren't available on the free plan, you can come back in here and look and see if those features are available. So you really know what you're getting and what you're downloading before you move forward uh, with basically getting involved heavily with a particular app on your store. Now, I think most people who do a service-based business or are doing appointments are gonna end up at least on the pro plan because you can only do one product. But I want to point out something here in the pro plan. These first two items here, obviously unlimited products. So you can do all different types of packages and different uh, appointments or lessons or services that you might offer. But the key one is right here, this email and text reminder. If they got rid of everything else in the pro plan, I think it's worth it if you just have the email and text reminder. For those of you that do any type of business where you have appointments or you need people to come in at a certain time or to show up, you know how valuable that can be to automate the process of sending out an email reminder or even better yet, depending on your clientele, if you could send a text reminder. So very valuable there, keep those things in mind. 
what we're going to work on in the tutorial is just the free product uh, plan so no need to go ahead no need to worry about buying a plan or anything like that so let's go ahead and scroll back up to the top and let's add the app let's add the app to our store and go through that process so like with most applications uh, when you click add app you're also going to be hit with an additional confirmation screen right here and that is showing uh, just making sure you know that this application is going to have access to all of these things uh, on the store so let's go ahead and install the app all right great so once you have the app installed on your store you're now going to be hit with the getting started or getting set up process for the application before we actually do anything i want to point out something here in this getting started guide i think this is one of the reasons why they have five stars with almost 100 reviews is any application that provides training one-on-one -on -one sessions and the ability to chat with us now that's just high marks for me i work with all different types of applications in shopify and when someone serves up all of their service and their support right off the top that is an excellent signal of the type of service and support that you're potentially going to be receiving from the application so high marks for putting that right there one of the reasons that i like that so first thing we need to do in setting this up is come right down here into the time zone go ahead and drop the time zone that you're in i'm in hawaii so i'll pick hawaii standard time and then go ahead and click get started now if you already have a shopify store set up and you have products in there, not service, not appointments, but products like let's say t-shirts or shoes or hats. That's not what you're gonna wanna connect with this app. You wanna set up the service-based product that you have in your store. So if you don't have that set up yet, it's not gonna show here. You won't have that option here as a available product. So in this demo store that I have set up where I do all my training and all my videos, I originally only had t-shirts because I was showing everybody how uh, to set up the Shopify store for a traditional product-based business. But in this case, I went back in and I created two additional products. So just like you would create a regular product, and if you haven't created a product in Shopify, I have a video and that link will pull up here uh, on the top and you can look at that, how to set up a product. So you'll set up your service-based product just like you would a regular product, which is what I did here. So I created two lessons. I created a private service lessons and a group surfing lessons uh, on there. So once you have that product set up for the service you're offering it'll show here and you can use that in this setup process so i'm going to go ahead and pick one product which is a surfing lessons private and remember we're on the free plan which is only one product so just stick with one so that we can go through the whole process of getting set up so once you click on the product that you want to get set up let's add that product to a pointo which is the app and that's going to take us here where we can now really get into more details in setting up the product and getting us ready for selling this as a service or offering appointments that people can purchase you know whether it's for lessons or um, a hair appointment or something else but we're going to get into this into the in the next video i just wanted to show you how to install it and get to this point in the next video we're going to continue on with this step here and doing the settings for the actual service-based product itself i'll see you in the next video